So this is Jake, and he said, what can we do now? I've got my TR2, my FF1. And I was like, hey, let's come up with a plan. Let's put it all together. We need to remember that the same rules apply. You need to set off left of the aircraft or right of the aircraft, but you need to go off the jump run perpendicular, make sure you're in safe space. So the first thing we're going to do is a track to track front flip, which we set up for and we make sure everything's right. Obviously, anything like this gets slicker the more you do it. So here we go, and he pops out, beam. That's awesome. And you can see that we've kept the aircraft head in, so we're still in safe space, and away we go. He nails it. And then a couple of seconds later, here we go again. We're going to throw a front flip into sim. And this is great. So at this point, everything's kind of amazing you up. But now we have a couple of little issues. We've started drifting. You can't really see it, but it becomes more apparent later on. So we're going to go for the grip anyway. We're head up and it's safe. Okay. Jake flies in, and if you look now, he makes a little bit of an error. He's a bit overexcited, and he leans forward, and by leaning forward, it pushes him back. Okay, but again, doesn't phase him. He regroups. This is looking good. He comes back in, and we're going to take it. And look, last minute, he leans too far forward, and it throws him out again. But again, we've got time. We're doing that. But now, I don't know if it's in the background. We've drifted right round. But it doesn't matter. He comes in. I throw my hand out. He takes the grip. This time, he breaks, but he's not overbraked. And then we take the grip, I let him go, and he doesn't disappear. Trouble now is that we've lost the headed, so we can't go back into tracking, so he decides to sit there, but after a day like today, it was fantastic, and one random clouds will scold it, but that's kind of in. But anyway, after this day, we have beers, a backstory, another great day at Hib, and thank you to all the staff. That was an amazing four days with over 30 jumps. He will definitely be back, but he's now on his way back to his DZ. We'll see him again next year for some head down, I think.